welcome back to my channel i hope you're doing really well so for today's video we are doing an and other stories clothing haul so i recently placed a fairly large order from and other stories well actually it's a funny story so i was going to an event last week so i placed an order online for delivery for some clothes and then i soon realized they would not come in time so i had to then go into town buy the same clothes and then inevitably ended up buying more clothes because i was in the shop and then I came home and then I had the delivery of the original parcel come a few days later. So we have a lot of clothes. So anyway, the point of this is I have a lot of clothes from under the stories. So I thought, why not do a try on haul and I can show you exactly what I bought. We have everything from blazers, skirts, jumpers, cardies, trousers, literally everything. So let's try these on together. So I have already taken pictures in these outfits. I'm going to put them up on the screen and then talk through each item, how I feel about it, how it fits, what the fabric's like, how much it costs, all those sort of things. So let's do that. So the first piece of clothing that I want to share with you is this gorgeous blazer. This is their oversized pinstripe blazer and it costs £165. Now I feel like this is worth it for the price because I don't mind spending a lot of money on jackets, blazers, coats, outerwear. I'm happy to pay a lot of money for, well not a lot of money, but I'm happy to pay a decent amount of money for high quality outerwear clothing. That's because you end up wearing them way more than you do normal jumpers. People see them, they are always on show. I feel like in winter my cost per wear for like my North Face jacket or my leather jacket is crazy because I'm always chucking it on whereas maybe like a jumper that I bought once maybe you know it's not getting worn as much as my coat is so to me the price is justified I think I put it away I'll go get it so this is the blazer in person you can kind of see it is like quite a textured blazer I like it. it's giving I don't know what it's giving it's giving it's taking me back to my school blazer <laughs> In a way, it's like quite a, you see the texture on that, hang on. So it's quite a textured blazer. It's almost woolly, if that makes sense. It's, it's warm, but it's not rigid. It is quite a flexible, like moldable um, blazer. I hate blazers that are very boxy and straight. This one is more movable, I guess, <laughs> if that's the right term. Um, I'm not sure if it's made out of, but anyway, one button in the centre. The next item that I want to share with you is their flared trousers. This is them here. I will insert the outfit pick in a minute. I'm just going through the components that make up the outfit number one. Okay, so these are the flared trousers. They are £77, which I think is really good. They are actually in the wash at the moment because I wore them on the weekend, but they are quite a thick material. It's a zip up the side. There's no belt buckle or anything it is just like a very fitted mm, tailored trouser with a little zip up the side they are very flattering they are very classy you could wear these as like work trousers but also like going out event trousers they are very nice the reason i bought these is because i have quite a lot of black and navy and cream smart pants but none that are beige so that's why i bought this pair the next item which makes it my first outfit is the mock neck sweater which is here this comes in at £45, which I, again, think is quite a good price for what you get. I was talking to somebody at work earlier about Under the Stories and how their products are sturdy. Like, they are high-quality, well-made products. So, for me, I'm happy to pay a little bit extra to know that I'm going to have high-quality products. So, that is why I'm happy with this jumper and all the clothing because it's really high quality. So anyway, this jumper has like, again, this one's in the wash, but this jumper has like a tight ribbed um, sleeve, like up and cuff, and then a ribbed neckline. It is really soft, but it's not too flimsy. It has quite a bit of structure to it. It's quite a sturdy jumper, but it is very, very nice. So outfit number one is this outfit here. This is how I paired these items together. I have on the beige trousers, the cream jumper, and then the blazer. I have paired these items with a pair of black painted heels and my beige coach bag. I really loved how this outfit came together. It's very classy, very comfy. I could wear this to, well, I could wear it to like a work event or I could wear it 
anywhere really. It's nice and versatile and it is super cute. I really liked it. I liked that as well, if I took off my blazer, I still looked put together. I often find that when you wear like, trousers and a top, your coat is then the like statement piece. Whereas if you take off your blazer, the jumper and the trousers speak for themselves. So that's why I loved this outfit. I'll insert another picture of my outfit here. This is just more of an outfit pick um, without me, more just the clothes. Okay, the next item is this gorgeous cardigan. This is their oversized knit cardigan and it comes in at £75. So for a cardi, yeah, it is quite expensive. It's definitely more on the expensive side. You could get something very similar at maybe like H&M or Zara, but it is very, very soft and very nice material. I believe it's actually down here. Let me go grab it. So here is the cardigan. It is so soft. Oh, it's gorgeous. So, oh, I love it. <laughs> so this cardi is very, very fluffy, very soft. Let me see if I can see what it's made out of. Alpaca wool, wool, polyamide? I don't know what that is, but <laughs> it's soft. I love a cardigan because I feel like, this is a bit of a weird one, but I feel like a cardigan is a dressing gown you can wear out <laughs> in my opinion they're soft they're comfy they're like easy to wrap around you but they're clothes not pajamas so love a cardi i feel like they're great as well for those days where it's not too cold you need something on and i feel like cardigans you can wear throughout winter with more layers and then come spring you're still wearing like a little shawl so cardigans are great in spring summer no obviously not but then autumn they come back out again so like i was saying for cost per wear you wear a cardigan a lot or I wear cardigans a lot so to me it was definitely worth the price so this is me pairing it with a pair of blue jeans and a white tee buttoned up it looks really cute it's giving grandma vibes a little bit but not too much and um, I really like it this to me is like a cute Sunday outfit I love this this is now me wearing it with it undone not buttoned up still with jeans and a white tee and again I love it I like it both ways but yeah Really, really do love this cardigan. This was an item that I actually didn't order online. So this is one that I picked up in store when I was frantically buying the items. And I'm glad that I did because I really love it. So that's the cardigan. Actually, also, I'll insert a picture of me wearing this cardigan with a pair of brown leggings, a white tee, and a cardigan, and it still looks like quite cute. Okay, the next item is this draped long sleeved blouse. So, this is something that I wouldn't usually buy. This like neckline really isn't something that I would reach for, but I was pleasantly surprised. It's classy, it's cute, it's a bit different, shows just the right amount of skin for me necklace sits nicely i just like it so i tried this top on with a few different trouser options here i have just paired it with a pair of jeans and black heels for a more casual look and i really like it so this top was 85 pounds definitely more of a going out evening wear kind of top i'm not actually sure if i'm going to keep this i'm still deciding i feel like it is nice but will i get a lot of wear out of it i don't know but i really like it i love it paired here with the jeans and the heels i think i could also pair this with a pair of like black trousers that would look really nice but yeah i do love it with the jeans so my next item is actually very similar but not quite this is the mock neck blouse this comes in at 65 pounds so it's actually very similar to the last item it's a black shirt very classy very evening wear sort of vibes but yeah very similar to the last item this shirt has quite tight cuffs and it is very high neck so it's like a full coverage sort of shirt but i like that i do like a high neck item um necklace over the top sort of vibe so here i have paired it again with a pair of jeans because i love that sandwich vibe for like black jeans black shoes i feel like it just goes quite nicely the next item is actually very similar again to the last item this is the volume volume oh, voluminous voluminous high neck blouse and this comes in at 85 pounds again this is definitely more of a luxury feel item again it has very tight cuffs and a high neck and it is quite sheer it's very it's very like airy fairy and 
classy and nice you could wear this tucked in or not tucked in when i was trying this on i tried it with black trousers the beige trousers from earlier i tried it with jeans and they looked really cute all like all the options look really nice for ease i put it on with the blue jeans so you can kind of see what sort of vibe it is with a pair of jeans and i really like it i like the white i don't know how i like them but i like them all this is my problem <laughs> i really really like this I feel like I said this earlier, but every item from Under the Stories just gives classy and high quality, just nice. You could wear this to work maybe, you could wear it on an evening out, meal, event, meeting. I just think it's so cute. I love it. So that is the white shirt coming in at, what was it, 87? 80? 85 pound. Okay, now the final item is the pleated herringbone mini skirt. So this skirt matches the blazer that I showed you at the beginning. So I'll go get it from sec. So this is the skirt. Again, it's reminding me of my school uniform. Um, this item I will be returning. I picked up this item in store. So when I went the other day, frantically shopping, this is what I picked up with the blazer and she's cute but i don't love her gonna be honest she's a little bit too long i'll insert a pic and um, this is the item on the website but this is how the item looks on so i have paired this skirt with the blazer and the white jumper from earlier and a pair of cute little um black heels and some tights it's a little bit too long for my liking on the picture it doesn't look too bad but it is, that, like the middle section for me is a little bit too long, covers a bit too much tummy. Um, so that is why I was not too keen. It also reminds me of my school uniform way too much. My school uniform was actually not as cool, but it was like green, but it, it's very similar, like the skirt and the pleats are very similar. So it's a no from me, only because, yeah, school uniform vibes and it's just not giving what I wanted to give. This skirt was, £87 as well and I feel like £87 for an item that I'm probably not going to wear is silly so this skirt will be going back. Okay so that is everything that I bought from and other stories. Just to recap we had the oversized blazer, the beige trousers, the cream jumper, the oversized knitted cardigan, the matching pinstripe skirt, we also had the black draped shirt, the black high neck shirt and the white cream high neck shirt. So I really hope you enjoyed this video. I really love filming clothing hauls for you all and I feel like this was such a nice one. I do love all the products from Under the Stories. It is definitely my cup of tea. So to film this video was super fun. So if you have liked this video, please don't forget to like, subscribe and drop a comment. I hope that I'll see you in my next video.